Praise the Lord. Hi everybody, I'm Sarah Gloria and I'm making this video from the train station. You know, this um, morning we went to the city of Amsterdam to evangelize. There are people who need to hear about Jesus. There are people who need to come to Christ because they haven't yet known Him. Jesus tells us in God's Word, the Bible, Jesus says, All power is given unto me in heaven and earth. And he says, Go ye, therefore. So all power is given to Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. And he sends us, he says, Go ye, therefore. He sends us in his power, not in our own power, to go, to go and evangelize, to go and share the gospel, to go and share God's word and the good news that Jesus Christ is Lord and he's alive and lives forevermore with people. <laughs> Uh, praise the Lord. Okay, there was a little interruption because of the announcement when that went on on the station. And so uh, there are people who still need to know the Lord because they haven't known Him. And they need to hear it. How will they believe unless they hear it? And Jesus sends us into all the world. He says, go ye into all the world. Now, first of all, let me tell you two things. Number one, you know, um, I've heard many people say like evangelism is not my thing and I was one of them always saying like evangelism is not my thing and there's the train and I used to say myself like evangelism is not my thing I'm a Bible teacher and I am a Bible teacher I still am so okay so I am a Bible teacher yes I still am that is my main calling but as I decided, you see a lot of disturbance here on the stations, train go, trains going behind me and all kinds of things. But, praise God, I am still Bible teacher, that's my main calling and it is good. Of course, we should, definitely we ought to stick to our main calling. But I decided to obey the Lord Jesus by an act of my will and to go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. And you see, we all have our own world. We all have people which only we meet. You know, most likely the people I meet are not the people you meet, you know, at least some of them. And, you know, and so, and most people need to hear the good news a number of times before they, before it gets through to them. So, even if we meet the same people, as we go ahead and we each do our job, God will work with us and they will come to the saving knowledge of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So, I want to encourage you, you know, do not say you're not an evangelist. Do not say you can't do it. When I first started, I couldn't like, you know, I really like, didn't feel comfortable talking to people, especially starting up a conversation. I could, as a teacher, you know, I felt it very easy to express my faith and to share with the people and tell them what I believe. But to start up a conversation was a real challenge for me. And as I decided to honor the Lord, He honored it and uh, helped me, you know. So do not say you're not an evangelist. Do not say you can't do it. Just ask the Lord to help you and to lead you in the specific ways He wants to use you. And just obey Him. He will do the rest. So we, you know, go and share with people the love of God. And many receive uh, Christ as Lord and Savior of their lives. Become born again, children of God and saved. And that's awesome. That's amazing. All glory be to His holy name. That's what I wanted to share with you today. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Bye-bye.